Question 1. Which physical property enables hydrocarbons to be separated during the process of fractional distillation? Well, I just summed that up with boiling point. That's right. So, back to our diagram once again. As I said, the smaller the hydrocarbon compound, the higher up on the column and the lower the boiling point. The larger the hydrocarbon, the lower down the column it will condense and the higher the boiling point. Now, just as another point to note, when we take things off a fractional distillation column, we call it elution. So elution basically means when, a when we use the physical property of boiling point, when something comes off at a different level, we say that it elutes or comes off, a bit like water out of a tap. So, now remembering this question, this will help us for the next question. So remember, boiling point and the different fractions will condense at different stages. So, to recap, longer chains, higher boiling point, lower down the column. And of course, shorter chains, lower boiling points, they will condense higher up the column. So, just to recap, if we had ethane, for example, I'll just draw that over here, just so that you can see the answers. If I had ethane, for example, which is C2H6, on a very small scale column in a laboratory, for example, and I also had, let's say, hexane with six carbons, one, two, three, four, five, six, hexane. Just imagine for me that these are all hydrogens then you could imagine that ethane would elute higher up the column and hexane would elute lower down the column. Longer chain, lower down the column.